Gemini 3 is all the rage and I wanted to show you how you can get it set up in Gemini CLI if you want to do so and the first thing you're going to do is go to your settings forward slash settings you can hit tab there and then it's this first uh, this first thing you see preview features eg models I've got it set to true but I was um, it was set to false before and I like to use Vim so I've got that true uh, if you hit enter it'll toggle it so that's how you enter it and then you can come and look at some of these other settings but when you're done you're gonna hit R and that's actually gonna exit Gemini to save those settings you'll re-enter back into Gemini and then you're going to want to confirm uh, if you see auto on the right you see this sort of purple uh, auto that's probably what you want um, but you can look at this by doing forward slash models or model and you'll see auto uh, lets the system choose the best model for your task um, so it's going to use Gemini uh, 3 Pro Preview ostensibly for something that's hard and then if there's something super simple it'll use a simpler uh, less costly model or you can come down here and manually set it to Gemini 3 Pro Preview with a fallback to Gemini 2.5 Pro and you can see it says when you select auto or pro Gemini CLI will attempt to use Gemini 3 Pro preview first before falling back to Gemini 2.5 Pro so I'm gonna leave it on auto and that's really all you need to do guys enjoy uh, this is a powerful model uh, probably the power most powerful that I've seen so uh, enjoy and also um, try some of the other stuff they released it's pretty amazing